hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel and if you're new here thank you for coming this channel is all things roller skating and if you're returning thank you for coming back and i hope this is another video that you enjoy if you hear some little dangly things down here it's literally just my hair i really just wanted to show you guys my little beads they are so cute aren't they yes they are they are i know they are i'm joking anyway um this is a quick video on must-haves as a beginner roller skater but little disclaimer you do not have to carry everything that i name if you don't if you choose not to this is not a video telling you what to do this is a video advising you what to do so this is everything that i carry or should be carrying and hopefully it can help you when packing your bag to go out roller skating first things first your bum bag or your backpack um i started off with a backpack because i used to pack so much unnecessary things when i went out skating um and now when i'm going out quick literally i take my bum bag because i really don't want to take any bag but the essentials do fit in here the second thing is um your tea tool so this tool if you don't know what it is it is to loosen and tighten your nuts and bolts i believe to take your bearings off and put them but i used to always carry it always always carry it and then when i would go skating like just around the corner i couldn't bother to like look for it and put it in my bag so i would leave without it and then one time i wanted to go skating I, luckily i'd put my skates on and i just noticed that my wheel was a bit loose i was like oh that means i'm gonna get go and get my skate tool so they're very it's very important guys because i could have not noticed that in the beginning gone skating far and my wheel could have popped off it's happened before so always always bring your skate tool make sure it fits in the bag that you uh want to take out simple easy peasy um some water this is something i miss out a lot i'm not gonna lie to you why because it doesn't fit in that small bag i just showed you can't lie but i get thirsty every single time and i'm like i could do with some water right now every time and it's like but you know this Asha. you could easily take your backpack and put the water in don't be like me guys don't be dehydrated like me because a lot of the time i will just be like yep i need to go home i'm too thirsty and i'll go home so yeah don't do that kids no, i'm joking not kids <laughs> um um take your water guys very necessary even if it's a cold day and you think you know what it's cold and what you're doing you're actually exercising um and it's very necessary to keep yourself hydrated some goddamn socks now this is really only necessary if your skates are uncomfortable these little babies are cool i don't need to pad them or anything my bowers on the other hand are so uncomfortable that i have to take spare socks with me so let's say i'm going i'm traveling to like a location to skate so i've got my trainers on i'll always keep socks in my bag because when i then i'm ready to put my skates on i have to stuff them forgetting your socks it's probably the worst thing you could ever do when you have uncomfortable skates if your skates are comfortable absolutely ignore this step next something i don't carry around um which i'm gonna start because i bought it but <laughs> this is important guys like a first aid kit can't lie very necessary very necessary I'm going to talk about some experiences where there's been a whole lot of blood. A whole lot of blood. Actually, I'm not going to talk about a few. I'm just going to talk about one experience. So I was with my skater friend, Ruan. And we were filming, you know, it was a contact kind of day. We were filming and whatnot. I don't know what happened. So we went into our separate, separate little corners to do our little skate something, something. And I'm on my phone. I come back to skate no more. I'm on my phone looking down. And I just see her on the floor. I'm like, you good? She like, she's like this. She always does this. When she falls, she'll be like this. I'm like, cool. So she's sitting there for a minute. But you know what? When people fall, sometimes they just want to sit down, recuperate, chill, and then they get back up. Little did I know her whole arm was cut open and she bleeding all the way out. I said, hold on, no, then this girl was bloody as hell. The part of the skating process just generally is, um, <laughs> 
fallen over and um, that's how you learn. I've fallen over today. Oh, it's dripping. Nah. I really don't want to go to a &E today. No, 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 no. I really do not want to go to a &E today. There's like a big circle of where you can just see it's grazed. This infect the area with some hands. <laughs> the thing is, as a skater, I would advise everyone to um, bring a plastic kit. We don't have any at the moment, but you know, yeah. it would have been very, very handy. We had to go ask a random piece of couple that was sitting down, oh, like, do you have any wipes, tissue, anything? If I had this, it could have been avoided. It could have been avoided. Like I said, it has your fans, you have your passwords. Like, I'm gonna, I don't know if I have hands inside, but I'm gonna have hands inside, but you can have it anyway. I'll whistle, I'm gonna, I'll whistle now. <laughs> Let's go again. <laughs> you, you basically got the full kit, do you know what I mean? This is definitely not gonna fit my side bag. <laughs> it's not. So I'm gonna be carrying a backpack from now on but yeah um obviously not if you skate around a lot of people obviously not everyone needs to carry this do you know what i mean but at least make sure one person in your group has this because it can save a lot of situations i'm telling you i've seen blood way too many times in my life and so yeah essential your headphones guys don't don't ever forget your headphones when you go out to skate it's the worst Listen, I have forgotten my head. Oh, oh th this is probably the most important thing. Because when I don't have headphones, I went on a street skate and my battery, these, these, the battery died. On a street skate. We went from South. Oh, where did we go? We went from South London, Catford, all the way to uh, Waterloo. And I had no headphones. I was listening to nature, bruv. I was listening to the cars. I was listening to the sound of our skates. I thought I'm crying. <laughs> Obviously, there's a few of us. I ain't trying to conversate when I'm doing a street skate. Obviously, you know, make little one, two conversations. But all I want to do is listen to my music. They, they died. So not only remember the headphones, but make sure they're charged if they're wireless. Or carry wired headphones. To avoid situations but yeah i use both of these um so these are the both i don't know if there's a version or anything but they're both headphones um i got these ones first because i really wanted over overhead headphones if that's what you call them i really wanted the chunkiness um you know when you just see skaters and you think you've got the headphones and they're just in their zone that is the look i was going for guys so i bought these bad boys they're not as loud as i wanted them to be if i'm being honest with you they are loud, but noise cancelling wise, obviously cancelling out every single sound is dangerous, I understand that. But sometimes I do want to be completely in my own zone and they just don't do it for me all the way. For the price that I paid personally, that's my personal opinion, you may beg to differ. Um, but I do love them nonetheless. So yeah, make sure they're charged up. And then I recently got some AirPods. <laughs> Check the brand in. Let's, let's have a look. Let's have a look. What does that say? No, you can't see it yet. No, okay, wait. <laughs> Come on, bad boy. Ace Skates. What does that say? Ace Skates. Okay, I'm joking. No, so I got um, some AirPods. And these are better noise cancelling than those. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. These are like my fave now. Um, when when do I take these out? If I'm not recording a video or I know I'm gonna record a video, I tend to take these because I don't want them to be seen. I don't think it's necessary. Um, and I really use these for work. So these are just too chunky to be carrying to work and putting in my bag. Like my bag's full enough, so I do take these to work. But skating wise, I mix and match. But yeah, don't forget your headphones. Unless you want to listen to nature and the cars and all of that. But if not, <laughs> remember your headphones. Wow, those are my... There's actually not much. You don't really need to take much when you go out skating. However, if you do carry more things, um, leave them in the comments. I want to know what you guys carry out when you go out to skate. Like, do you carry a bag or do you not? Like, let me know, let me know. One last thing, make sure you have a fire playlist okay so i use i use spotify i use spotify litty i actually have some playlists um on my page let me get them up for you 
um, got some cool ones that I've made public. If you want to check them out, the link is in my bio on Instagram. And actually, I'll put the link down below too. I've got a hip hop playlist, Afro beats, old school, chilled groove, um, in my feelings, upbeat groove, and dipping slash sexy session. That's probably my best playlist. It has every song. You can imagine when you want to slow it down, when you want to wind it, <laughs> when you want to do all of that, that's the playlist you want. Even if you're not skating, that's a bad boy playlist. Um, I think that's actually it. There's, yeah, not much. Let me know what you guys take skate to skating with you. Let me know if it depends on what you're doing. Like, let's say you're going to a rink. What do you carry? If you're going outdoor skating, what do you carry? Let me know it all. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was as informative as I wanted it to be. Please hit the like button if you ain't liked it and also subscribe if you haven't subscribed because it will mean the world to me um, and thank you and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you.